Part 2, Teacher Tasks Doing Certain Combat Move in P.E. Class Throwing Basketball in Hoop in P.E. Class Kicking, Throwing Football in P.E. Class Running Laps in P.E. Class Bringing Food in Cookery Class Setting Items and Furniture on Fire in the Cooking Class If you fail to complete these tasks the teacher might lower your grade. Tasks that might get the player the trouble. Fighting a classmate slash teacher slash civilian. Killing a classmate slash teacher slash civilian. Delivering an item to other NPC, as the police might accuse you of dealing items. Starting a fire in a certain place. Getting out of debt, sometimes. Getting certain stats, such as agility, up to a certain amount, the teachers don't like that, so be careful. Arriving too late to a class. Punishments. If the player is caught doing an offense and is deemed guilty of the offense by the principal, there's a chance that they'll get punished depending on the offense committed. Detention The player is stuck in a classroom alongside some students and teachers and won't be allowed to leave until around 9 o'clock a.m. If the player does manage to leave the classroom, they will get suspended for escaping detention. Advertisement. Suspension. The player is forced to miss school for the rest of the week, resulting in lots of missed tests and a significant decrease in average grade. Getting expelled if the player has committed multiple offenses and is deemed by the principal as having no place in the school, they will get expelled. In the free version, this punishment ends the game permanently and the player won't graduate. In the private version, however, the player becomes a civilian. Fun if the player character has a large amount of money. They will be forced to pay a $100 fine and return to school scot-free. Phone calls The player may occasionally receive a phone call, either on the school's telephones or a mobile phone. These random calls will vary, being useful, such as giving the player a mission for money or revealing a random answer related to a random subject, or useless. Advertise other mdicky games or prank calls. Amanda Hugginkus This call is a reference to one of Bart Simpson's brain calls on Mo. After receiving this call, the player will lose half of their sanity. Task call An unknown person will call the player and give them one of the tasks mentioned above. The person will call again if player has failed or completed the task. Advertisement Threatening call An unknown person will call the player character and threatens that they will kill them the next time they see them. The player loses sanity after receiving this call and needs to be cautious as the person could be anywhere on the map. Asking player's location An unknown person will call the player, ask them where they are and tell them they should be in a certain class inside the school. Revealing their location An unknown person will call the player, telling them who they are and where they are in case they need to find them. Mission reminder This call simply reminds player of the mission they current have. A random answer This call simply gives the player an answer to a random question on a random subject. Game advertisement This call will advertise other Mdiki games and give you a link to their download page or Mdiki's Facebook page. Selling your rights. Rare. This call will give the player the option to sell their rights to a journalist, movie studio which results in a large sum of money. Note, keep in mind that the player character's rights can only be sold once per semester. If they call again in the same semester, they will tell them that their rights has already been sold to another company, the character's money will be returned. Advertisement Random Fact About a Place By far this is the most useless call in the entire game. This call will simply give the player a fact about a prop or item in a certain place, for example, did you know that there is a toilet in the bathroom? Requesting for a meetup at a place an NPC will call and request the player to meet with them at a random place before a certain deadline, usually outside of school. When the player arrives, the NPC will tell them something or simply become their friend. Telemarketing Some store will call and advertise their products. If it's a furniture store, they will also say that they deliver to the player's home, the bedroom. The world you're living in isn't real This phone call will tell the player character that the world you're living in isn't real and it's just an illusion. The player character's sanity will decrease by half after receiving this call. Trivia If your character passes out, but is grappled by a teacher, the screen's black fade will reverse. In the editor, it is revealed that Angelo Escobar has a sister named Gretchen Cosby. In the editor, 
Bart Simpson is actually female. This is possibly referencing the fact that the voice actor who plays Bart Simpson is a woman. When you get expelled or graduate, you're now a civilian, and when you pause and check the timetable, all of the subjects are free and locations are none. The private school version was deleted off the App Store and possibly the Play Store. Categories Community content is available under CC BISA unless otherwise noted. And I have good news. Fake Jason and fake patients killed the police officers and escaped jail. Yay 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 Without being said, we are going to Speedway next. Not to be confused with Raceway, a brand of racetrack, Speedway, company type subsidiary industry retail, convenience store, founded 1952, first incarnation. 1976, second incarnation as brand, July 18, 1997 26 years ago, as subsidiary, defunct 1962, first incarnation, May 14, 2021 two years ago, as subsidiary, brand name continues in use, fate acquired by 7-Eleven, brand name continues to be used. 1, Headquarters 500 Speedway Driving on, Ohio. U.S. number of locations 3,923, December 31, 2018 to, Key People Tim Griffith, President Revenue $23.55 billion, 2018 to, Net Income $1,028 million, 2018 to, Owner 7i Holdings Number of Employees 40,230, 2018 to, Parent Marathon Oil, 1959A 2011, Marathon Petroleum, 2011A 2021, 7-Eleven, 2021A Present, Website www.speedway.com A typical Speedway fuel station and store in Cambridge, Massachusetts A Speedway fountain drink machine on Neville Island in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, after 7-Eleven's purchase of Speedway featuring Big Gulp branded soft drinks. Speedway is an American convenience store and fuel station chain headquartered in Anon, Ohio, with locations primarily in the Midwest and the East Coast regions of the United States, however there are many located in the southwestern U.S., wholly owned and operated by 7-Eleven. Speedway stations are located in 36 states, up significantly from its core seven-state region in the Midwest since 2012. Prior to 2021, the company was a wholly owned subsidiary of the Marathon Petroleum Corporation. It is the largest convenience store chain in central Ohio. 3. Speedway started in 1952 as Speedway 79, the name of a fuel chain based in Michigan. Unlike other fuel station chains at the time, Speedway 79 did not have a service station to perform vehicle maintenance, but rather vending machines that focused on cigarette and soft drink sales, giving their locations the nickname Smokes and Cokes. The 79 denoted the octane rating of Speedway's gasoline. In 1959, Marathon Oil, then known as the Ohio Oil Company, purchased the chain and in 1962 converted its outlets to the Marathon brand. 8. A self-service fuel became legalized in many states. In 1976 Marathon decided to use Speedway, without the 79, as 87 octane had become the standard at this point. At higher volume self-service stations with convenience stores, some of the first were converted from Oshkosh, Wisconsin-based consolidated stores, which at the time had locations in Wisconsin and Michigan. These stores were converted to the Speedway name throughout the 1970s and 1980s after Marathon acquired Consolidated. 9. The concept turned out to be one of the few bright spots for Marathon during this time due to the 1970s energy crisis. 
and the company quickly expanded this concept across Marathon's main territories across the Midwest and southeastern United States. Part of this expansion was through the acquisition of various other smaller regional fuel station chains, including Gas America, Starvin Marvine, Gastown, Wake Up, Bonded, United, Checker, Port, Ickel, and value. These stations were converted to the Speedway branding. Stations acquired in the Checker deal included former Inco stations that Checker acquired after they were sold off by Exxon in 1977. 10. Legally, Marathon's convenience store business was known as Imro Marketing Company during this period. 11. Getting its name from placing an E in front of Marathon Oil's ticker symbol, MRO. Speedway adopted its current logo known as the Moving S, in 1982. In 1997, Marathon and Ashland Petroleum formed Marathon Ashland Petroleum LLC, MAP, a joint venture which combined the company's refining, marketing, and transportation businesses, with Marathon owning 62% of the operations while Ashland owned 38%. In the process, Ashland's Super America and Marathon Speedway convenience store chains were merged to form Speedway Super America LLC, a wholly owned subsidiary of MAP. At this time, Marathon acquired the rights to the Solo, Save Mart, Save More, and Rich brands from Ashland, along with others. Many of these brands would be converted to the Speedway brand over time. When the merger was completed in 1998, the Speedway and Super America brands began to market together. Marathon Ashland also purchased Total Petroleum of Alma, Michigan, in 1999. 12. The stations, which had been previously owned by Diamond Shamrock, were mostly in the state of Michigan. Most former Total locations were then rebranded to Marathon, Speedway, or Rich. 13. Speedway acquired the 50-unit Welsh Mart chain of Michigan and Indiana in 2001. 14. This was followed in 2002 by the acquisition of 30 stores from Grand Rapids, Michigan-based Crystal Flash. 15. In 2003, Marathon sold off Speedway's southeastern stores to Sunoco, who promptly converted them to the a brand while selling Sunoco fuel. 16. While Speedway's stores in western Pennsylvania were sold off to independent owners and converted to standard marathon stations, withdrawing the Speedway brand from Pennsylvania and south of West Virginia and Kentucky for a decade, Speedway became one of the first convenience store chains in the industry to launch a loyalty program when it launched Speedy Rewards in 2004. The program was launched almost by accident. Marathon had launched a similar program for its traditional Marathon-branded fuel stations but found inconsistent use among its franchise owners and felt that the program might work better with Speedway, since all of its locations were owned and operated directly by Marathon. The program has since been ranked by multiple independent publications as being the best loyalty program on the market. 17. In 2005, Marathon purchased Ashland's share of Marathon Ashland Petroleum, which became Marathon Petroleum Company LLC, retaining the Super America and Rich brands that were originally owned by Ashland. At this time the locations outside the Upper Midwest were converted to Speedway and the Super America brand was restricted to the Upper Midwest market. Marathon sold Super America to Northern Tier Energy a newly formed company backed by the private equity firm Zakin Investments and TPG Capital, in February 2011. It is based in Woodbury, Minnesota. Speedway and Super America became unrelated chains until seven years later, when Marathon bought Endeavor, to own Super America's parent company Western Refining. Following the separation of Marathon's upstream and downstream operations in 2011, Speedway remained a part of Marathon's downstream operations. In 2001, Speedway's truck stop chain was merged into the Pilot Travel Center's brand after Marathon and Pilot Corporation entered into a partnership to form Pilot Travel Centers. Pilot has since bought out Marathon's interest in Pilot Travel Centers, now Pilot Flying J following its merger with Hess Corporation's retail chain in 2014. 
Six Wilco Hess locations in Virginia were rebranded as pilot locations and jointly operated between Pilot Flying J and Speedway. 18. On June 23, 2016, Pilot Flying J and Speedway announced a new joint venture between the two companies that will see 41 Speedway locations, all former Wilco Hess locations and 79 pilot flying J locations primarily in the southeastern United States form PFJ Southeast LLC. The locations will be operated by Pilot Flying J and the Speedway locations will be rebranded as either Pilot or Flying J19. As of December 9, 2014, 12% of Speedway stores carry E85 ethanol. 20. Speedway currently has 326 stores with E85 available, and one store which carries CNG. Almost all of its stores in Greater Pittsburgh as well as its stores in the state of Tennessee offer E85, greatly expanding the availability of the fuel in these respective markets. Expansion since 2012 Map of states containing at least one Speedway fuel station as of December 2019 Red indicates Speedway's core Midwestern states prior to its 2012 expansion, Green indicates former Hess stations, Orange indicates both former Hess stations and states where Speedway was already expanding into organically prior to the Hess purchase, and Blue from the former Andover properties including the Super America chain that Speedway owned and operated from 1997 to 2011. Map of Speedway locations as of August 2020, the date of the announced purchase by 7-Eleven, 2012 A14 expansion on February 13, 2012. It was announced that a deal had been reached with Indiana and Ohio convenience store chain Gas America to acquire all 88 of its locations. 21. Speedway also acquired all trademarks, trade dress and intellectual property from Gas America 22, and included several parcels of undeveloped real estate for future development. The transaction was finalized on May 29, 2012, for an unspecified price. 23. On June 5, 2012, it was reported that Speedway LLC signed a deal with the convenience store chain Road Ranger. The deal gave Speedway nine Road Ranger stores in Kentucky, and one in Ohio, in exchange for cash and a truck stop in the Chicago metropolitan area. 24. Rockford, Illinois based Road Ranger operates approximately 80 truck stop and fuel convenience store locations in seven Midwestern states, like Speedway before it. Road Ranger has a partnership with Pilot Flying J. In May 2014, Speedway announced they would purchase Hess Corporation's retail business for $2.6 billion. Hess has 1,342 locations along the eastern United States. 25. Some Hess stations in the northeastern United States originated as Merritt Oil stations until Hess bought the company in 2000. Post has expansion on April 30, 2018, Marathon agreed to buy Andover, an independent refinery and oil company based in the western United States, for $23 billion. On October 1, 2018, the merger was completed. The merger brought all Super America locations once again under the ownership of Speedway, but instead of retaining the Super America brand, it was phased out in favor of the Speedway moniker. 2627. The merger also brought the Speedway brand to California, Utah, and the American Southwest for the first time, becoming a coast to coast chain. On April 16, 2018, it was announced that all 78 Express Mart locations were being rebranded as Speedway locations, which follows Marathon's acquisition of Express Mart, a chain based in Syracuse, New York, that co branded with competitors such as Sunoco and Mobile. 28. Speedway and MPC closed on the acquisition of Express Mart in November 2018, after being required by the FTC to divest of five stores. 29. In 2019, they purchased 33 Nico Express locations in western New York. 30. On October 31, Marathon Petroleum has announced the plans of spinning off Speedway into an independent company. 31. In May 2020, as many as 30 Speedway store locations were damaged by looting and rioting during the George Floyd protests in Minneapolis St. Paul, with nine locations suffering extensive arson damage. 
3233-34. On June 6, 2020, Duncan announced plans to close all Duncan Express locations at Speedway locations, which Speedway acquired as part of the acquisition of Hess Retail Business in 2014, by the end of the year. 35. In 2023, Speedway began gaining national attention when multiple locations that struggle with crime and loitering began playing loud opera music on a 24-7 loop to help deter loitering. The music has received mixed responses and in some cases negative responses from residents and other businesses in the area. 36-37 Other brands a rich location on West Fair Avenue in Lancaster, Ohio. In 2022 while Speedway had consolidated most of its other brands into the Speedway banner by the late 1990s, Speedway continued to operate other brands following major acquisitions aside from Spray Mecca, primarily for lower volume locations that remain corporate owned. The most notable of these brands was Rich. Rich Oil was a discount brand offered by Ashland and initially was retained following their acquisition of Super America strictly to keep the trademark valid. Following the creation of Marathon Ashland Petroleum, Rich was selected for lower volume stores that basically fit the profile of the original concept of Speedway 79. These stores typically only sell tobacco, snacks, and drinks inside and do not participate in the Speedy Rewards program. Rich, however, does take Speedway gift cards. Following Marathon Petroleum's acquisition of Andiver, company-owned stations in California that otherwise would have met the criteria to be branded as Rich were instead branded as Speedway Express. The decision to create the Speedway Express brand instead of using Rich was due to Speedway in general being new to the California market and helping to establish the Speedway banner there. Unlike Rich, Speedway Express accepts the Speedy Rewards card. Separation from Marathon Petroleum and sale to 7i Holdings Co. LT did a Speedway fuel pump with a 7-Eleven pump topper in Columbus, Ohio, in November 2021. In late 2018, Marathon announced their intentions to spin off Speedway into an independent company by the end of 2020. 3831. In February 2020, it was reported that 7i Holdings Co. LT did the parent company of convenience store chain 7-Eleven planned to buy Speedway for $22 billion. 39, however, due to investor concerns that the offer was too high, as well as the potential impact the COVID-19 pandemic would have on the economy, the company abandoned the idea the following month. 40. Despite initially abandoning the acquisition, on August 2, 2020, Marathon announced that 7i Holdings Co. Limited would be acquiring Speedway for $21 billion. 4567, the deal closed on May 14, 2021, despite protests from the Federal Trade Commission. 141. On June 25, 2021, the Federal Trade Commission, Marathon, and 7-Eleven agreed on the divestitures of 291 Speedway and two 7-Eleven stores to three companies, Anna B. Oil doing business as Rebel Convenience Stores, Cross America Partners, and Jackson's Food Stores. As part of the agreement, Marathon and 7-Eleven must seek FTC approval to reacquire the stores for five years after the sale. Most of the stores being sold off are in California, Florida, and New York. 4243 7-Eleven has not disclosed publicly the future of the Speedway chain but it is expected that the two chains' respective loyalty programs, 7 Rewards and Speedy Rewards, will be merged. 7-Eleven slowly started rebranding many Speedway products in November 2021, starting with Speedway's Club Chill Speedy Freeze Drinks being rebranded under the Big Gulp and Slurpee names respectively, while Speedway's store brand products such as Speedy Choice Snacks and Anon Springs Bottled Water started being replaced by 7-Eleven's own 7 Select in December 2021. Many fans of Speedy Freeze complained on social media about the drink being replaced by Slurpee-branded products, though other frozen drink fans have said the two drinks are identical. 44. 7-Eleven also removed Speedway from Pilot Flying J's 1-9 fueling network for truck drivers in favor of their own 7-Fleet fueling network. 
In March 2022, Speedway began replacing its roller grill items such as Tornadoes and Egg Rolls with 7-Eleven's proprietary Big Bite products such as Large Hot Dogs, Cheeseburger Links, and Taquitos. Throughout 2022, Speedway locations that had Speedway's own Speedy Cafe Tilda Copyright Quick Service Restaurant concept had their Cafe Tilda Copyright S gradually replaced by 7-Eleven's own concepts, either Raise the Roost Chicken Biscuits or Laredo Taco Company, the latter of which was acquired when 7-Eleven purchased Stripes Convenience Stores. 45. As part of the deal, Marathon agreed to supply the Speedway locations with fuel for 15 years. If 7-Eleven decides to convert the Speedway brand name over to 7-Eleven, it is not known if the locations would sell 7-Eleven branded fuel or sell Marathon or Arco branded fuel. Prior to the deal, Marathon had an existing partnership with 7-Eleven, mostly in Appalachia. 44. In a departure from its marathon days, in March 2023 7-Eleven announced plans to install its seven charge electric vehicle charging stations across all of its spanners including Speedway. The charging stations support CCS and Chademo plugs, as well as Tesla vehicles with an adapter. 46. Public Relations A corporate partner of Children's Miracle Network Hospitals since 1991, Speedway has raised more than $100 million over the past 26 years for the charity through a variety of fundraising activities. Speedway LLC raised $10.3 million for Children's Miracle Network Hospitals in 2017. 47. The partnership between Speedway and Children's Miracle Network Hospitals was strong enough by the time of the 7-Eleven deal that 7-Eleven itself became a partner with Children's Miracle Network Hospitals in 2022. 48. Speedway was ranked the fourth worst company to work for in the United States in 2018, with work-life balance and senior management as major detractors to the work environment. 49. These issues are highlighted in the memoir. Corporate Lunacy Behind the Scenes of America's Worst Gas Station, written by Rob Clooney. 50. Speedway LLC was the official fuel of the NTT IndyCar Series, and Indianapolis Motor Speedway from 2019 through 2022. Continuing from the 2012 formulation the fuel spec was the 85 race fuel, 51, 52, and announced their endorsement of LPGA Golf for Ally Ewing. 53. Welcome to Speedway. How can we help you? 7A, Wack Hacks, Blockbuster, Samira Jaffa, Zach Pack, Walter Beaver, even though he graduated and is now a teacher again, Michael Keaton, Dwayne Schwartz, Anthony Chinoki and Scarlet Bones, 7B. Jimmy Sierra, Les Berlin, Jay Enrico, Keith Slazinger, Pang Pack, Aka, Pang Pang, Andrew Head. Todd Dearden and Chris Pierce. Bruh, we didn't ask. Our wasting our time again. You know what? Just get the hell out of here. Shut the fuck up.